Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I want to share with you my holiday gift guide. These are the things that I would love to give as gifts to someone else, or these are gifts that I would love to receive myself. So I'm going to start with no particular order, and everything I mentioned in this video, the link to where to purchase it will be in the description box below. So the first thing I have is this organic ginger turmeric herbal tea from Trader Joe's. I was in Trader Joe's I think last week and I'm a teaholic. I love drinking tea. I drink about three to four cups a day and I'm always on the lookout for new tea. And I saw this because I was specifically looking for something with turmeric in it and I've never seen this before at Trader Joe's. So I picked it up and it's amazing. So the ingredients in it are organic ginger root, organic turmeric, organic licorice, organic orange peel, organic orange oil and organic black pepper. This is a great tea for this time of the year and especially since we're all getting sick and we want to keep our immunity high. Turmeric is really good for that. Ginger is really good for digestion and licorice root is really good for your like throat. So it's kind of a sweeter tea. It's really good as like a stocking stuffer. Another really good stocking stuffer would be Tio Organic Fair Trade Chocolate. And I'm a really really big fan of this company because they're fair trade, they're organic, and they have really high quality ingredients. This is my favorite chocolate the pure 85% dark chocolate. And the ingredients in it are cacao beans, cane sugar, cacao butter, ground vanilla beans. So just four ingredients in the chocolate. How freaking awesome is that? They also have other flavors like salted caramel. I think they have like a cherry almond. Just a bunch of, bunch of really good flavors. It's really good high quality chocolate. So again, it's a great stocking stuffer. Now if I were to buy some makeup, I would get makeup from Pacifica. They are a cruelty vegan makeup company. And I specifically here have a Stellar Gaze Length and Strength Mineral Mascara. I really like it. It's a very simple wand. You can see that. And it's cruelty free, it's vegan. And they have also have you know blush, powder, eyeliner, just lip stuff. So a lot of just nice cruelty free vegan makeup. So the next thing I have is essential oils. I'm a huge, huge fan of essential oils and diffusing them and wearing them. I just love the way they smell, the way they feel, and how holistic and natural they are. So I have a few here. I have doTERRA is the company. So I have doTERRA's Past Tense, doTERRA's Deep Blue, doTERRA's Clary Calm, and doTERRA's Intune. So I'm going to explain what each one of these is for. So this one is one that I wear every single day. I use it as my perfume and this is a focus blend. So you literally just take it and I apply it on my pressure points. Oops. Like on my neck. And it's just uplifting, invigorating. It helps you focus. It helps you stay calm. It helps you ground yourself. And I wear this every day as my perfume. And a quick funny story. I was traveling the other week coming back to Colorado and I was going through security and the TSA officer stops me. He's like, Oh my gosh, you smell so good. What are you wearing? And I'm like, in tune. What's that? Oh, it's a doTERRA essential oil. And she was just like, it smells amazing. Where can I get that? So it's really, really good if you're looking for a more natural, holistic route to perfume. And it's really uplifting and helps you stay focused. The next one I have is the Past Tense Tension Blend. And this is great for grounding yourself. If you have a headache, if you feel stressed, if your energy kind of feels frantic, if you're a little worried, and oh, it just smells so good. I like this on my temples, like right there. Like rub it in. Maybe on my elbows here, but it's really good for grounding your energy and just calming you down, calming energy down. Um, you could even wear this before you meditate. It's really good for that. The next one is Deep Blue. And this is great for muscle soreness or joint soreness. So if you're experiencing some kind of fatigue in your muscles, tightness and aching, you can just apply that to any area of your body and just rub it in and it kind of cools it. It really helps alleviate any kind of tension or aching you have and it's just really good for that. I don't use this one too often because I don't tend to get muscle aches, but when I do, I definitely will. So the next one is Clary Calm, which is monthly blend for women. And this is great if you have period cramps and you just put it on your belly and you rub it right in and it really just, it really helps to kind of calm your uterus down and just alleviate the pain of your period and it smells really good too. And I would also use this if you have any kind of muscle tension like in your back 
it's a great spot to kind of just treat muscle soreness as well. So a great bag I would recommend, I don't have mine with me because it's still in storage, is the Vegan Tote from Free People. I received it around this time last year. And it's a great travel bag. It's really big, really wide, fits all your stuff in it. Um, I usually carry it when I travel, like my laptop will go in it, my journal will go in it. I took it to Hawaii earlier this year. Just a great work bag too, so you get to go to work, take it to the office. It's just a really nice, big, good quality vegan leather bag. It reminds me of the Madewell bag, but I was looking for a more vegan friendly option. So when I found this, this was great because it looks similar aesthetics to that. It's really big, it's really wide, it's really handy, really sturdy. The perfume of choice that I love and that I would suggest is the Tracy Reese perfume. You can buy this at Anthropology. Um, I bought mine, I want to say over a year ago. And I've only gone through half of it, as you can see. It has very floral tones, so gardenia. I smell gardenia. I'm not really good at describing perfumes, but the most prominent smell I get is gardenia, like a fresh spring day. It is by far my most favorite perfume I've ever come across. And I'm not a big perfume wearer, so I'll wear this occasionally. Most of the time I'll just stick to my essential oils. But if you're looking for a perfume or you want to give someone a perfume, this is amazing. It smells wonderful. It's just, I don't know, it makes me happy. It's like a happy scent. That's the way I would describe it. This one's good. This one's my favorite. So this is my Great Gatsby sweatshirt. You've seen me wear this in a lot of my videos actually. And I wear this when I travel and I get so many compliments on it. And so many people ask me where I got it from. And they like see the reference or like that's a great book or a great movie. And I think this would be a great present to give someone. This company makes a lot of sweatshirts of books. So the other ones I've seen is where the wild things are um, and this one. but. This is a great gift to give someone, especially people who love books. This is one of my favorite books. Actually, this is the first book I've ever read. So get receiving this, I actually got this for Christmas last year. So it's like kind of a sentimental thing. And then when I wear it, everyone recognizes it because everyone's either seen the movie or the book. So it's really cozy, it's really big. I have it in size medium. This is one of the newer things I've introduced in my life is a Himalayan crystal salt lamp. And I heard seeing these around and I kind of, have teetered and kind of seen and heard the benefits of it but I really didn't buy one and I got one and it's amazing first of all it's a really soothing kind of warm light and I have mine my next to my bed and it's really good for um, electromagnetic radiation so um, things emit positive ions into the air and it neutralizes it into negative ions so we don't know what the effects of electromagnetic radiation are because we can't see these electromagnetic waves and I mean in the next 50 hundred years we'll know how they're affecting our body this is good to counteract electromagnetic radiation and it emits negative ions into the atmosphere and kind of diffuse and diffuse all this energy um, it's really good for cleaning the air it's really good if you have asthma um, respiratory problems allergies I'm kind of slightly allergic to my cats so ever since I got it I've noticed my allergies Pet dander have gone down significantly, improves quality of sleep. So this is great to put into your desk at your home office or at work. And it's really good for that electromagnetic radiation I'm talking about, but it's really good for leveling the energy up and raising the frequency and the vibration of your space. It's just really, really calming. And it's a great stress reducer, so it's just a great thing to have around your house, like one in your office, one in your kid's bedroom, um, one in your living room. It's just really good for the home. So as many of you know, I love reading and I love reading self-help and spirituality and self-development books. So I highly recommend a Kindle. Um, I got my Kindle two years ago, no, I think three years ago now, and it's really convenient, it's really easy. I could just download all my books onto it and all my books are in one place. And it's great for when I'm traveling because I don't have to carry all my books with me. But the books I would recommend that you get for your Kindle or if you're giving someone a present, um, the Kindle, you can download these books for them. And the books I recommend are this book called Spiritual Growth by Sonia Roman. This is one of my favorite books. I refer to this book constantly and I love using it um, when I'm coaching my clients. So this is a great book if you're just beginning your, your spiritual journey or um, on your spiritual path and looking for more guidance. So this is a great book to start the new year with. The next book I recommend is Asking is Given by Jerry and Esther Hicks. I love this book because it's learning to manifest your desires and it's 
one of my favorite books because I love referring back to it. They have these amazing exercises you can do to reprogram how your mind works and to reprogram how to understand that you're the creator of your reality and that you can have anything you desire. And if you're into my channel, obviously you want to create a thriving life. So these two books would be a great way to start your new year and you can just download, download them to your Kindle. So this holiday guide cannot be complete without jewelry because everybody loves jewelry, especially women. <laughs> Um, the jewelry company that I love and I would recommend is Dog Your Jewelry. I have a beautiful dainty necklace from them. This is a little love bug. And I received this as actually a birthday present, but it's just so meaningful. And they have really meaningful and very self-expressive jewelry on there. So the person in your life, you can cater each piece to according to them. And this love bug is one of my favorite pieces from them, but they have... Um, you know, a karma ring, they have angel wings, they have a bee, they have the state that you're from. They're just really beautiful, dainty jewelry, so it's really good for everyday wear, and it's just really simple, and it's a great way for the person you're giving gift to to be able to express themselves and to know what's important. The last thing I have for you is journals, because this gift guide would not be complete without a journal recommendation. recommendation recommendation because I love journaling. I love the decomposition notebooks. Those are my favorite go-to journals. Again, I don't have mine with me because it's in storage and I'm currently not using a decomposition notebook as my journal, but it's decomposition so it's a recycled paper and it's just they have these beautiful prints on them. Um, I have one with cats in space, and I have one with a unicorn on it, and then I have one with little bugs all over it, and then they just have really cute covers on them and there's one with constellations on them and they're really good for morning pages if you do morning pages or mind dump writing conscious streamer writing and they're really good as your journal they're really sturdy they're really strong and i just love using them and i'm the type of person who likes to have the same journal so like if i could put them on a shelf that's all the same journals i could just pull one out i know this is from 2013. i like to just label mine in the months of the months i use it so then it's like a kind of like a volume i have so that's the journals i recommend I hope this video serves you. I hope you have a beautiful holiday season. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. I will see you again, most likely in the new year. And the last thing I wanna quickly add in, because this wouldn't be complete without this, is I'm currently offering 15% off on all my coaching packages. So you can do a single session, you could do a five, month, five session pass, or you can do a three month coaching program with me, and everything is 15% off up until December 24th. At midnight. If you're interested in that, send me a message and we can get to working together so you can have a beautiful, thriving new year. Wherever in the world, I wish you a miraculous day. Stay open.